they are sports fans. Um, we're uh, now putting the crankshaft in for the final time. Uh, the seal, of course, you have to remember that the oil is trying to get out. So you put the lip of the seal in and it, the, uh, the package shows how it goes. The lip goes towards the motor, as you can see here. But, you know, when you get the, you get the seal, they'll, they'll show you how to put it in. But remember that the oil's trying to get out. It's not trying to get in. And uh, we put some uh, assembly lube on each of the bottom um, of the five main bearing. <clears throat> and then uh, the two of us monkeys uh, put the uh, crankshaft in carefully. Don't forget about the RTV. Uh, right? The RTV, of course, goes on the... If you look at the main bearing cap, there'll be a little chamfer on here. And you put the RTV on there because that chamfer, if you look at the back of the block, is open a little bit. So you want RTV to seal that. That's why you put it on that chamfer. And then you don't have leaks in your driveway? Yeah, you don't want leaks. You don't want oil coming out of there. Uh, it would be a small amount if it came out, but you don't want it. So, uh, and now we're just snugging these up and then we will start to torque them. Um, on, a, on a V8, you start in the center and you, and you work yourself out. So you end up doing the, the two uh, front and rears and uh, that's pretty much it. Uh, make sure you check your torque specs with the ARP yeah, Molly Lube. Yeah, do steps probably, uh, three steps, uh, 40, 50 pounds. You want to end up at 110 foot-pounds. Now we put the molly on the washer and the threads so that the uh, you get a, uh, a consistent torque reading. Uh, and these are 200,000 pound bolts, so they're, they're premium bolts. So it should hold the bottom of this, this engine together very nicely. All right, so we're gonna torque in a specific sequence, then we'll be back. That's it.